Hi there everybody, welcome to my channel. I'm Katie and I want to do a video for you. My very first video about natural living. So, what we do, what I really try to buckle down and do to boost immune systems, to increase healing and shorten the time and the severity of any illness, um, depends on the illness. So this is what I do when we have a cold bug, something where we're coughing, sneezing, sore throats, stuffy noses, itchy eyes, those sorts of things. So I've got it all set up here, the things that I do that I love. So the first one I'm going to show you is just a piece of paper. Can you read that? Bone broth. Okay, if you don't make bone broth, it is the elixir of the gods. It is truly liquid gold. Bone broth is so full of vitamins and minerals and nutrients. And when grandma says a bowl of chicken noodle soup is going to make you better, and I'm quoting my brother here, she is not talking about Campbell's chicken noodle soup. She is talking about bone broth and whatever you happen to put in it. But the bone broth is where all that power packed nutrition, immune boosting support comes from. So we love Wish Garden herbs and I use a variety of their formulas. This one is for kids specifically. It's called Kick It Immune for Kids. And we also have the daily immune for kids. And quite honestly, they don't take their daily daily. When they're sick, I just go on my mom instinct on whether I'm going to use the kick it or the daily. I have them in my cabinet all the time. Cabinet. So can you see that? So it says to mix it with water or juice. My kids... <laughs> They'll just take it straight into their mouth and then take a drink of water to chase it down. So, to each his own. Okay, this is a product that I think I am actually going to discontinue using, but we will see if I see a lot of difference once I do that in how fast and how well people are getting over their little viruses. So, so this is a homeopathic that's only available through professionals. So I get this from a chiropractor and the company is Physica and the formula is Virotox. And one of the things I really like about this homeopathic is that um, it isn't just homeopathic ingredients that you would find in a health food store like Arnica and, you know, Calendula. It's more things like um, thyroid and different glands and stuff like that, adrenal, stuff like that that is formulated into a homeopathic. So I really like this. It is in distilled alcohol or green alcohol, um, distilled water, cane alcohol. So it tastes terrible, but again, my kids just take it and drink it and it's fine. For them, at least. Okay. The next one is my essential oils. So, so that's frankincense, oregano, and on guard. So, my kids are little oils addicts. They love them especially my three-year-old, because it's fun and it's hands-on and they smell good. Um, but I just use these on their feet. I also use them here, like on their glands, like when you go to the doctor, and all over their throat sometimes. Sometimes I do them on their lymph nodes here to help the body drain. Um, my sister's son, I hope he never sees this, he'll kill me. Um, but his lymph nodes and glands in his groin get really swollen when he's sick. So if my kids had that, I would definitely put those there. So I just feel like these are a trio of super power packed oils, not specific to any one ailment, but good for all ailments and all prevention. 
Okay. This is a blend, a rollerball blend that I concocted on my own based on my own knowledge of herbs and oils and their benefits for different things. So I labeled it cough. That is just the biggest word I can fit on this tiny sticker. Um, I would say it's for anything with opening the airways, airways and decongesting your body. So um, if you have a stuffy nose, if you have a runny nose, if you have stuffy ears, if you have gunk in your throat that kind of is hard to breathe through, um, any kind of coughing or restricted airways. Um, I use this also when my kids are sick with a cold because you just always feel so gunked up from here to here. It helps kind of open all that up. So I use a lot of essential oils in here. I use 10 drops of rosemary, 10 drops of eucalyptus, 10 drops of thyme. Thyme is amazing. It literally opens your bronchioles. It's amazing. 10 drops of lavender. Those are all for kind of opening the airways and relaxing, you know, your sinuses and all of that. Then I also add five drops of On Guard and five drops of frankincense. It smells really good and it's really soothing. I honestly used to take these exact oils and put them into um, a combination of like shea butter and coconut oil and beeswax and melt it into an herbal chest rub. And we just hated the way it felt. It was sticky and our clothes were sticking to it and our hair, we all have long hair, was sticking to it. This is a lot better. You know, I do those oils and then fill the rest with fractionated coconut oil, which is really light as far, far as oils go and soaks in. And if it does get on something, it doesn't look oily. Um, so I love this roller ball and I always have it filled up. Um, these two people, I don't know how I had sick kids with colds ever before I had my diffuser and these two oils. I am so serial, not even kidding. These are a blessing on my life that I cannot emphasize enough. So I take my diffuser, which I love my diffuser. It has lights, so it lights up the room like a little nightlight and it goes on and off every five minutes. So it runs for 10 total hours. So it can be on all night long without having to be refilled. Invest in a good diffuser that does that, that lasts a long time. So you're not trying to get up and fill it in the middle of the night, turning on lights and waking up your kids. So I fill my diffuser and I put 10 drops each of these oils. I put 10 drops of Serenity, which is a very sweet smell. I love Serenity. I'm not gonna open that. That's actually an unopened bottle. But it's very comforting and relaxing and, and has oils in it that are to help you sleep and be calm and restful. Okay, and the other one is Breathe, which I don't know how I did having sick kids without this in my diffuser, both of them. They are able to sleep. They are able to breathe. I don't hear them going <coughs> and choking on their own snot. Now, I do also try to elevate their heads. I elevate their heads so that things are tending to drain and they don't get as stuffy. And then I have the diffuser on at night. They can sleep. Like, you can't get better if you can't sleep. I can't believe I ever had sick kids without breathe and serenity in my diffuser every night they're sick. It's amazing. Okay. A huge thing. If you're sick, stay hydrated. That's part of that is here. Bone broth. Sometimes I'll throw in some electrolytes in their water. I have a really tasty one uh, or some vitamin C, which isn't as tasty, but that's good. But these are optional and extra. I don't always do those. I didn't do those this time. But what I do, if they're dehydrated more often, is I give them coconut water, C2O. I like it for two reasons. One, it doesn't have anything added. It's got one ingredient. 
okay? 100% coconut water, that is all. And it's not from concentrate. So I, I keep these always in my house for summertime when people get dehydrated, for if somebody's sick, for if somebody's been really exerting themselves and working out a lot. Always, always I have these coconut waters. This one is like the king of coconut waters because it's not pasteurized, so it maintains all the natural antioxidants and um, the coloring too. It'll be pink, which other coconut waters are um, kind of mostly clear. So yeah, I really like this one also. Again, it's a little pricey, but as a once in a while boost, I definitely love that. Okay, one more thing. This is one store-bought homeopathic with multiple ingredients that I adore. Just as good as the Breathe in Serenity. Just as incredible. Absolutely never without it in my house. I have the one that's open always in my house plus a backup because I am unwilling to be without it. Cough syrup. Now, this is not a cold syrup. The same company makes a cold and cough blend. I don't like it. Didn't have the best results with it. But this one literally only treats a cough. So, um, but this is all homeopathics for a cough. So you don't just start pumping this into your kids as soon as they have a little bit of a fever. I only use it when they are actively coughing. One thing that I was unused to when I first started using it is that you dose every two hours with this cough syrup. That can be good and bad. If they have a horrible cough, which once in a while my kids do, and they are just coughing and coughing and coughing and it's so hard to sleep through, that can be hard when you have to get up every two hours because it does wear off right at about two hours. But what it also allows that I really love is that I'm not overdosing my kids. I'm not giving them a conventional cough syrup that's lasting for 10 or 12 hours when they only needed it for 30 minutes in their bodies. Um, also, it's natural ingredients. So um, this company is called Chestol or Chestol, and it's the children's cough and chest congestion formula. So it's not the cough and cold formula. It's the cough and chest congestion formula. Okay? I'm back. I had a kid wake up. Okay, so one of my favorite things about that cough medication is that it has an ingredient that specifically thins excretions to help it make it easier for kids to get that chest conge congestion out. So to help thin that stuff and then it comes out it helps that wet productive cough to be productive that is amazing that is exactly what we want that is exactly how the healing process is supposed to go and it's just aiding your body literally aiding your body in what it needs to do and what it's already doing but giving them that little bit of help um I think that's it. Thankfully, I am feeling better, my three-year-old's feeling better, and my eight-year-old usually gets a raging fever, goes to sleep, hardly moves for a day or two, hardly eats or drinks, and is better when she wakes up. So she's about three-quarters of the way on that cycle. So we should be good for rehearsals tomorrow. I hope everybody has a great night. I'm so glad to be here and doing videos again. I feel like I missed eons, even though it was only a few days. Take care, everybody. Bye.